You are about to see one of the craziest and most amazing places we have ever stayed in our life. This channel is run by myself and my husband, Jermaine. We are the couple behind travel check-ins. In this video, we are in Africa. We are staying at the Kikorok Lodge in the Maasai Mara. That's right, you guys, in the middle of the best parts of Kenya. Let me tell you a little bit about this room that we're staying in. This particular lodge opened in 1965. It is in the direct path of the annual migration. And the annual migration is when you start seeing all the animals leave from one side of the Maasai Mara to the other side because of the droughts and they're looking for water. It's in the middle of the Maasai Mara where you can enjoy sightings of hippos and zebras grazing in the lodge. And there are no lies told when they tell you that because at night you cannot just walk the grounds by yourself. You actually have to get an escort because wild animals are literally sitting in the tree line looking at you. My biggest takeaway for staying at a lodge on the Maasai Mara National Reserve is don't be dumb. Listen to what the people tell you to do and not do because these are wild animals out here and you want to be safe and you want to have an amazing experience. So this is our bedroom. And from our room, there's usually a lot of animals out here because this area is not um, a fenced resort. Um, if you can see out there, there is no fence. So, um, especially at night, you have to walk with security because zebra can come in from that area. Hippos will come in, just pretty much anything. So there was a hippo in here last night, which is super dangerous. Um, zebras and all different kinds of animals you'll find in here. Monkeys. everything being in such close proximity with different animals in the wild like this can be a little jarring at first at least it was for me especially these monkeys i remember when we were at a different location and it seemed like the monkeys were trying to surround me on the pathway what I do is I just don't walk by myself because I do notice the little monkeys, they can get a little aggressive. They will take your stuff. And that's why you have grounds people around with either a stick or a little slingshot to make sure the monkeys don't get out of hand. So it's a, a wonderful experience. It's just a different experience. One thing you'll notice as you watch this Kenya series is the different types of terrain. In some of our videos, you will see we are in a more drier, arid type of environment and some will be a more lush and green type of environment like this one here. We are still on the property. We're heading down to the hippo pool and down here, we're gonna go see if we can find some hippos. This property has a hippo pond with a lot of adult and baby hippos in it where you can go watch them and you're in a raised environment so you're not on the same level as them so it's completely safe. <laughs> still scared. Yeah, I'm glad it wasn't and she's still scared. I know. It's scared of Everything. This is one of several lodges that we've stayed in in Kenya and this is one that we highly recommend. Our biggest reason for recommending it is the ability to interact with wildlife in a real Africa setting. There are two ways you can book here. You can book where you have your room and then you buy your food a la carte, or you can book as an all-inclusive where you're lodging and your food is all included. They have a large dining hall where they sell food and serve food buffet style every day for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So if you're enjoying this video and you're finding it informative, I would love for you to go ahead and hit the like button. And then also, if you wanna make sure you keep up with the series, I invite you to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss when we post the next video.